It's your boy, we back, MLB. In the last video, the kid was crushing the baseball again. Had, I believe, three doubles in four games. Drove in a run, but yet we're still not receiving a call up to the AAA. The kid is out batting everyone on his team. Every team he plays, he's out batting everyone. In this next series that we have to continue from the last video, can the kid after this series get a call to the AAA for the New York Mets? We're going to play our next game. <coughs> Hello and welcome. Thanks for joining us. Minor League Baseball from the double-A level coming up. It's the Hartford Yard Goats and the Binghamton Rumble Ponies. And, now, and we'll be back with the first Binghamton pitch right after this. Rumble Pony. One of the issues, I think, with us being called up, actually, I just remembered, is that Aguado Escobar plays third for the Mets, who is better than us. Will the kid get traded? I wonder. Here comes the kid up to bat. We're already down two to nothing, but lately the, the team has been playing amazing. We've been winning games, coming back in games. There's a runner on first and third. Nobody moved. The kid is ready for this moment it's nick bush again last time nick bush came out i took him yard and i thought that was going to be a base hit but it didn't base is empty with two away another batter now ryan snyder he's all for one come on big guy you got this measures six feet even only 18 years old and he was a third round pick in 2023 be nice and patient, one at a time. We have a challenge. Hit a single or better. Power swing for a hit. Only swing at pitches inside the zone. We have to power swing. We have to go for the program hey, stars. We're still down two to nothing. The kid has to lock in. And I'm going to power ball. swing at that. And I fouled it off. That was kind of high. Time, right the kid now. just needs to stay calm, cool, look, collected. We need to get this Pitch. hitting streak continued. As I ground out to first. The kid is just not making plays this game so far. We're at a slow start. We're just getting destroyed by the yard goats. Was the last couple of games the flu? We're down five to nothing. I am swinging at that, and I am driving that deep. Again, the kid delivers with another double. 64 speed. Can he make it home? Can the kid drive in another run? No, he cannot. It was a good effort. It was a good effort. The kid drove the baseball. I mean, I'm not even mad. He, nope. He, he almost made it. He almost made it. I'm not going to steal third. We have 62 speed, same as last time. I also realized last time my guy was bald when I did the face scan, and I didn't even notice. So I put some hair on my guy because I'm not bald, but I did put some hair on my guy. We're down five to nothing. Another comeback? Is this another comeback for the Rumble Ponies? Advance a runner. Contact. We're going to... Excuse me. We're going to advance a runner for the equipment back. Can the kid do it again? Can the kid drive down the line? And... No. No, 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 no. And I got thrown out. Play made. That ends the inning. So it's... We take the lead. I'm telling you, bro, this team is cracked right now. Another challenge. We're going to contact something for it. I'm not even going to look at the other two because I want these program stars. This team is cracked. I was like, we're getting demolished, and now we came back, and I'm swinging at horrible pitches. I don't know what I'm doing right now. We can end the game right here. We have to make this play. We have to go to second. And we have to go to first. Righty delivers. We're going to go second. The ground, the third might be two. Get him at first. Get him at first. Perfect. The Rumble Ponies win. The kid only had one hit. 
A double almost drove in a run with it, but the guy got thrown out at home. But the hitting streak lives on. And the kid is playing absolutely amazing. One for five, but who even cares, right? We got a hit. Who even cares? Everything progressed, so it doesn't even matter. This series has been so fun. I really can't wait to get called up, though, but now I'm not really sure because I forgot Escobar plays third. So I don't know what they're going to do. Again, we're down, but it doesn't matter. 24-game hitting streak. But, yeah, I don't know what they're going to do now because I don't want to play another position. I want to play the field. I mean, I guess I would play somewhere else in the infield, but I really want to play third. That's one of the problems. That's going to be driven not in the gap. And this guy's going to cut it off. And I thought he was going to try to go to third with it to try to throw the guy out at third. I didn't think he was going to do that. All right. We're going to go to – we're just going to go to first. There's already two outs, so it's fine. We don't have to go for the double play. But, yeah, I wonder if I'm going to get traded. I don't know who needs a third baseman at the moment. But I know the Mets have some. The Mets have a good team. So, like, I can't play shortstop because Lindor is there. Pete Alonzo plays first, and McNeil's plays second. Three for nine on the series for the kid. I'm one for one for the day. We're down two to one. So I wonder if I'm going to get, I wonder if I'm going to get traded before I get called up to AAA. I have one home run for the Roman Ponies. I'm tied third on the team. So I wonder if I just keep on playing. I wonder if that's one of the reasons why I haven't got called up because Brett Beatty actually is in the AAA. For the Mets, he just got called up in real life, and he's actually really good. Maybe that's why they can't call me up. So then just trade me then, because you're just wasting my talent then. Why don't they just... I, I wish I could like call my agent in the game and be like, yo, can you just tell them to trade me? Because now they're just wasting my talent. Because they just want me to keep on playing at double A level, but I'm out here destroying these guys. He just ran, and that was actually really smart. Because now he's going to third. I'm not going to be stupid like I was last time and go to second. I'm just going to stay at first because now we have runners on the corner. Joe Rock is getting demolished out here, even though his team is up. She want see people. I see people have to be getting called up because I don't even know some of these guys now. Some of these guys aren't even guys we started the season with, like Ashford. I don't know who that is. And we just tied the game, even even though I was talking smack about this guy. He just beat out to play at first. Now we're up 5-2. to two, Batting 409, one home run, 19 RBIs on the season. But some of these guys, I don't even know who they are. So people are getting called up and called down. So why aren't I? I, I mean, they're not going to... They're not going to... That's another base hit. See, the kid is delivering. He's going to go to third with 64 speed. What a, what a, what a route to run. But... Yeah, I they want to steal. I can steal. Yeah, some of these guys, though, I don't know. So I feel like 62 speed has been the move. Two stolen bases in two games. The kid is getting it. Three stolen bases on the year. But some of these guys, yeah, like Ashford, that's what I'm saying. So they need to, like, call me up then. Or trade me. I don't, I don't even care where I go at this point. Because they're just wasting my talent, and I feel like... I feel like on another team, I could really give them something. I mean, I could give the Mets something, but they're not going to put me in over Escobar. I just know it. They're not going to do that. Did this guy just deliver? Oh, what a hit, bro. He's going to get... That's going to go all the way to the wall. Is he going to get to third with 61 speed? Do it. Go for it. Oh, he stopped. He probably would have made it. We're up 7-2. to two. We're just destroying the yard goats right now. And, of course, we won. I'm not even surprised. But I'm going to try to finish this series in this video because I want to see what happens. Because I want to be called up because I feel like they're just wasting my talent. Which really sucks because when I got drafted to the Mets, I was like, oh, my God, I really want to play for the Mets. Because I never played for the Mets before in this game. But I just don't think it's a possibility. The only way it could happen, I think, is if Escobar gets injured. But, but I mean... He would have to get injured for the season. So, like, if he doesn't get injured for the season and he's only on, like, the 15-day DL or 60-day DL, he's just going to come back in and they're just going to sit me down. Because they're not going to trade Escobar. 
And like I said, I don't I don't want to play. I don't want to really play anywhere else. Which means that Alonzo or Lindor would have to get hurt. And I don't want to play the outfield. So, I don't know. It's kind of a weird situation. Like I said, I didn't. I forgot that Escobar was there. So, now I think that's why I'm not being called up. Because there's no way. There's no way. Like, I just don't know why they wouldn't call me up. Batting over 400 consecutively over almost a 30-game hitting streak. Which, speaking of that, we have to make sure we continue our hitting streak in this episode. This team is unstoppable right now, though. We're up 5 to nothing. The tables have turned. We started off rough in the beginning of the year. There's a runner on second. If I could drive him in, that would be huge. But, yeah, I don't want to play anywhere else. The kid has to lock him. We have to continue this hitting streak. And I absolutely did not. But, yeah, I feel like any other team would have called me up by now. And I feel like the Mets are just... I feel like they're basically just screwing me over. But maybe not. Maybe maybe they're trying to figure out how to get rid of Escobar. Maybe they realize that I'm the real deal and Escobar isn't anything. Because let me tell you, when I watch him in real life on TV, he doesn't do a damn thing. All right. Batting 407. One home run, 19 RBIs. Hit a home run. Contact swing. We're going to contact swing for a hit. We have to get on base because I think we're only going to come up like one or two more times, and I don't want this hitting streak to end. We have to take Caleb Yard. Okay. That's going to be an out. Yeah. I'm getting good contact, but I really, I'm going to be really sad if my hitting streak ends at, I believe, 25 games, I think it is. All right. We have to lock in. Eli. Can we? Dude. I keep on thinking I'm going to get a hold of it, and I'm not. Please don't let the hitting streak end. Are they going to go for a bunt? Oh, I'm moving up. Go ahead and bunt. How fast is this guy? 57 speed? Yeah, I'm going to get him at second. We're not going to get him at first, but I wanted to get the I wanted to get the fourth. Not that it matters because we're up 8 to nothing, but who even cares? Okay. Ryan They're giving me another challenge. I'm going to drive and run. I'm just going to go for drive and run. I have to come up to the plate and drive this run, and I have to continue my hitting streak. I'd be so sad, especially since we're home. That was the pitch to hit. That was the pitch to hit. The kid needs to lock in. It's it's a long at bat. And the hitting streak. And the hitting streak comes to an end. No way. Wow. After I think twenty five consecutive games, the hitting streak is snapped for the kid. We did get the win, but damn, zero for five. That's really sad. I really can't believe the hitting streak ended. But all good things must come to an end, right? So now we're going to start a new hitting streak. But damn, bro. That's really sad. I was really seeing the baseball. I'm first on Roman Ponies, batting 397. I was batting 400, but I just went over 5. There's a runner on third. We have to take Jeff Criswell. Yard. Go ahead, hit me. Put me on base. That's so sad. Usually right now the hitting streak would pop up if there's not one. That's all right. We're playing home. We got the win. We blew him out last game. I'm going to swing at that. And I'm going to tap a foul. But the kid's been playing great. I'm 50 clutch. I mean, I'm still 58 overall because I'm working on the program stars. Dude, I keep on swinging at high pitches, and I'm not making contact. He's not going to get home. All right. We're going to go to second. If it's a ground ball, we're going to second. I'm backing up because I feel like he's going to smash it at me. Hmm, exactly what I said. We're going to go to second. 65 speed. Can we get him at first? Got him. Double play. I remember when the season started, the kid was having a problem with fielding. We're up one nothing. The kid was having a problem fielding the ball and making the correct read. Now the kid is out here getting every out possible he can. That's a strike. Look at the crowd today. 
The crowd is here to see the kid. There's no other reason they come here. It's to see me. And of course, I get a base hit now. But yesterday, I went 0 for 5 to end my hitting streak. I have 63 speed, so those stealing, stealing the bases and stuff helps your attributes go up. So I kind of hope it's a full count. I might try to steal. There's no way going to throw me out. There's no way going to throw me out. I don't think so. Of course, the one time I try to steal, it's a fly ball. Yeah, yeah, there's no way you were going to throw me out from, from left field, dude. Oh my god, it's a Monte. I re dude, why don't they let me steal so much? Monte? A Monte. A Monte. Comes through in the clutch. I'm getting the third. I'm not going to go home. No, 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 because no, it's in the infield. I don't want to get thrown out. Almonte delivered. Dude, I remember when the season started. Almonte was horrible. Literally horrible. He was batting like .71. Now, this guy has come alive. Jalen Davis is back in the lineup. This guy's a beast, too. And he... He walked him to load the bases. Luke Ryder. You can be the hero here, bro. Just put one... In the gap, or just look at a pitch right down the middle. Brandon. Well, Brandon, at least he went down swinging, unlike the last guy who just looked right at it. We're now losing four to one. Last game we were, or the game before we were losing like five to nothing though, and then we came back, so it's fine. We got this. There's a runner on second, batting 353 with runners in scoring right position. Comes up empty on the As I say that, I swung the ball and way outside. And then I grounded it out. But you know what? It's fine. I feel like any team, even the Mets, I feel like any team would want me on their squad. Bottom of the six, Stephen Jones is out here. We're down six to two. Runner on first, and that's a base hit. I mean, the kid delivers. See, the one thing about the kid that any team he goes to, he's consistently, or he's consistent. I mean, Gomez at that. Yeah, any team the kid goes to, he will provide consistency for them. But I just don't think it's going to be the Mets. I really don't. He just lined that to third, I believe. Yeah, I just don't think it's going to be the Mets. We're just getting absolutely destroyed. I mean, we've been destroying them, so it's totally fine. But I just don't think it's going to be the Mets. I mean, even though I'm consistently out here hitting, consistently making plays in the field, consistently driving runners in, I just don't think it's going to be the Mets. I think they have too much talent for me to go there. Um, we're going to go with contact swing for a hit. There's no way I'm going to draw a walk. They throw me pitches down the middle all the time. But I just don't think it would be the Mets. But, which is fine. Because, honestly, I don't want to go. I thought he was going to catch that, bro. I was going to be so mad. I, I don't really want to go to a team that's, like, superpowers. Uh, I didn't contact swing. That was a power swing. Even though I hit contact swing, it's fine. That team is, like, charged up. So, I don't, I don't really mind going there, not going there. I don't know who I would like to go to though. I mean, when I played, I've played this game before, and there's some teams that I've been to. So I mean, it wouldn't matter if we go to the team the team that I've been to already. But I'm interested to see who even wants us. Like I said, I don't know. Yeah, Monte. I don't know who needs a third baseman. But like I said, it's not the Mets. And in order for me to play any other position, people would have to get hurt for like a long time. And I don't want to play the outfield. And I don't want to play catcher. And I don't want to be a pitcher. So our options for the Mets are pretty slim. Which I'm surprised they drafted me. That's what blows my mind. All right, so we finished the series. We're going to go back to the clubhouse. That's what blows my mind is that the Mets drafted me, but they don't need me. So why did you draft me? Like I said, unless they're trying to figure out something with Escobar. But why would you draft me if you don't need my position?
Didn't I hit A? Yeah, I did. Coach draws a player's attention to a recent trend in his numbers. Hitting coach. I can't remember the last time you drew a walk. Maybe you could be a little more selective about your swing out. That discipline can earn you better pitches than match. Well, coach, I don't know if you've been watching me batting, I don't know, 400 with almost 20 RBIs and a home run. Um, They don't throw me balls like that, coach. But, yeah, sure, I'll try to draw a walk. No problem. Again, nothing happens. So... Maybe next game, maybe next series. I don't know. I feel like my talent is being wasted here because the Mets don't need me. But I hope you guys are enjoying this. I will see you guys in the next one. Make sure you hit, hit that thumbs up. Give me a like if you like what you see. Go ahead and hit that sub button. Um, it'll let you know when I drop videos. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a good rest of your day. Bye-bye, everyone.